Good morning students. How are you all? I hope you all are fine at your home taking proper care of yourself. Students, today we are going to do the grammar worksheet of lesson number 4. So quickly take out your pearl book page number 63. 63, 63. So take out your pearl book, one sharp pencil and eraser. Okay kids? So the first exercise, first I am going to read the question. Match the today words with the yesterday words. So here what we have to do, we have to match the today words with the yesterday words. Okay. So jo today, jo present form mein hai, humko usko kis ke saath match karna hai? Past tense ke saath, jo past ho gaya. So jo past ho gaya, usme word ke aage ED lag jata hai. Okay kids. So we have to match the word today words with its same word in yesterday form in past tense form okay so the first word is play and we will match the word play with played play with played now the second word is talk and if we will change it in past form past tense then it will be talked so match the second one with D1. Now we will match the third word watch with watch which is written in E. Watched. ED. Okay. Now the fourth word is dance and we will match it with danced. Fourth one with C1. Fifth one walk with A1. Walked. And the sixth one wash with washed. So in the first column, words are written in today's form and in the second column, the words are written in yesterday form. Okay, so jo yesterday ki usme convert ho jata hai, past tense mein usme ed lag jata hai. Okay kids, so now we are going to do the next exercise. Now kids, in the second exercise, what we have to do? Circle the correct words to complete the sentences. So the first word sentence is the school was closed or closed during the summer vacation summer vacation means jo cheez beat chuki hai aur jo cheez beat chuki hai usme hum ed lagate hain okay so the circle closed c l o s e d closed now the second one i celebrated or celebrate my birthday yesterday yesterday means jo be chuka hai. So circle it celebrated. Circle the word celebrated. Jo be chuka hai. Iske last pe kya laga hai? Ed. Now the third sentence. Saroja dash her clothes before going to the office. Office jane se pehle. Means be chuka hai. So Saroja aren't ed one. Okay. Now the fourth Priya dashed the cricket match yesterday. Yesterday means it already happened. Okay. So write Priya watched. W-A-T-C-H-E-D. Now the fifth one. The frog dash into the pond. The frog jump into the pond. The frog jumped into the pond. The frog jumped into the pond. J-U-M-P-E-D. Jumped. My sister dashed the plants. My sister watered the plant. So, W-A-T-E-R-E-D. Watered. Okay. Now, students, we are going to do the next exercise. Now, kids, in this exercise, what we have to do? Add E-D to the words in the box and filling the blanks. So, students, here filling the blanks is given. And what we have to do? Words are given in the box itself. But we have to add E-D on it. Okay? Humko jo words box mein diye huye, wo words to use karne hai. But humko us word mein E-D bhi lagana hai. Okay, kids? So, the first one, Rohan dashed the ball. Rohan kicked the ball. So, which word will come over here? Kick. Or kick ko hum kya kar denge usme? ED laga denge. Okay? Now, the second one, the ice cream in the bowl dash quickly. 
melted quickly so the word melt is written over here we will write that word and we will add ed on it so it will become melted now the third one father dash the clothes in the washing machine father washed okay so we will write here the word wash and we will add ed on it so it will become washed now the fourth one this mango tree was dashed by my grandmother this mango tree was planted so the word plant is written over here we are going to add ed on it so it will become planted now the fifth one hurry dash for the train at the station hurry waited for the train so the word wait is written over here add ed on it now the sixth one the children dash with the little kitten the children played the children played with the little kitten now the seventh one the monkeys dash from one tree to another the monkeys jumped so the word jump is written over here we will add ed on it now the last one the children dash the teacher good morning the children wished their teacher good morning so in this exercise what we have to do words are given in the box and we have to select the correct word related to the sentence which will match with the sentence and one more thing we have to do we have to add ed on it ed hum kis word mein add karte hain jo cheez हो चुकी होती है बीत चुकी होती है पास्ट टेंस में होती है ओके नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डू द नेक्स्ट एक्सरसाइज नाउ स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस एक्सरसाइज व्हाट वी हैव टू डू फिलिंग द ब्लैंक्स विद द येस्टरडे फॉर्म ऑफ द वर्ड्स इन द ब्रैकेट सो योर इन द ब्रैकेट वर्ड इज रिटर्न ओवर योर एंड वॉट वी हैव टू डू वी हैव टू चेंज इट इन द येस्टरडे फॉर्म पास्ट फॉर्म ओके सो पास्ट फॉर्म में लिखने के लिए हमें क्या करना पड़ता है उस वर्ड के आगे ई डी एड करना होता है ओके सो इन द फर्स्ट ब्लैंक आई डैश द क्रिकेट मैच ऑन द टेलीविजन ब्रैकेट में क्या लिखा है वॉच सो आई वॉच्ड डब्ल्यू ए टी सी एच ई डी वॉच्ड हमें ई डी इसमें एड करना है ओके नाउ द सेकेंड वन the monkey dash up the tree and in the bracket what is written over here climb so right climbed the monkey climbed up the tree c l i m b e d climbed now the third one my sister dash to school and in the bracket walk is written over here my sister walked w a l k e d walked okay now the fourth one the fruit seller dash his shop and in the bracket what is written over here open the fruit seller opened o p e n e d opened the fruit seller opened his shop now the last one the gardener dash water on the plants and in the bracket spray is written over here so we will write sprayed s p r a y e d sprayed the gardener sprayed water on the plants so students in this exercise what we have to do filling the blank is given over here and the word is written in the bracket what we have to do we have to change it into past tense in yesterday form so what we have to do we have to add ed with the word okay now we are going to do the next exercise now students in this exercise what we have to do write the yesterday words drop y and add ied so words are written over here and what we have to do we have to change it into yesterday words past tense me and here what we have to do the uh, words can you see all these words all these words starts from uh, ends with which letter y all these words end with which letter y so here what we have to do we have to drop the letter y to last letter y hai humko usko hata dena hai aur uske jagah humko kya add karna hai ied 
to change it into past tense yesterday words may change karne ke liye okay so the first word what is written over here reply the first word what is written over here reply and what we will be doing we have to remove y from here and we have to add i e d so the word will be r e p l i e d replied now the second word is worry so we have to remove the letter y the last letter y and we have to add i e d so the word will be worried w o r r i e d worried now the third word is copy again we have to remove the last letter y and we have to add i e d so it will be copied c o p i e d copied now the fourth word is fry and what we are going to write fried f r i e d fried now the fifth word is supply again we will remove the last letter y and we will add i e d so it will be supplied s u p p l i e d supplied now the last word is spy and what we are going to do we are going to add i e d it will be spied s p i e d spied so students in this exercise what we have to do the words are written in today's form and we have to change into yesterday form तो हम ई डी एड करते हैं बट जब लास्ट में जो वर्ड के लास्ट में वाई होता है उसको चेंज करने के लिए हमको वाई को हटा के आई ई डी एड करना होता है ओके किड्स नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डू द नेक्स्ट एक्सरसाइज नाउ स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस एक्सरसाइज व्हाट वी हैव टू डू सर्कल द डूइंग वर्ड्स इन दिस पोएम so poem is written over here and here what we have to do we have to circle the doing words that means action words to action over it doing words okay so in the first line i can tie my shoelaces to kya kar sakti hai wo tie means ban sakti hai to first word is tie now in the second line i can brush my hair so in the second line what is the doing word it is ब्रश सो सर्कल द वर्ड ब्रश हो वही हो वो अपने हेयर को क्या कर सकती है ब्रश कर सकती है नाउ द थर्ड लाइन आई कैन वॉश माई फेस एंड हैंड्स सो वॉट शी कैन डू शी कैन वॉश हर फेस सो वॉश इज द डूइंग वर्ड एंड इन द नेक्स्ट लाइन एंड ड्राई माई सेल्फ विद केयर ड्राई ड्राई इज ऑल्सो द डूइंग वर्ड नाउ इन द नेक्स्ट लाइन आई कैन क्लीन माई टीथ so what she can do she can clean saaf kar sakti hai now fasten up my frocks so again circle the word fasten i can dress all by myself so what is the doing word dress wo khud ko dress up kar sakti hai and pull up both my socks wo socks ko kya kar sakti pull kar sakti utha sakti okay so i had circle all the doing words action words now here what we have to do write the yesterday words for any four words you have circled so humne jo itne sare word ko circle kiya hai we have to select any four words and what we have to do we have to change it into yesterday form so what we have to do we have to add ed on the word so i had selected the word washed सो so, जो यहाँ पर वॉश लिखा है हम उसको इसमें ई डी एड करके वॉश कर देंगे डब्ल्यू ए एस एच ई डी वॉश नाउ द सेकेंड वर्ड आई है सेलेक्टेड ड्रेस सो आई एम गोइंग टू एड ई डी ऑन एड सो इट विल बी ड्रेस्ड डी आर ई डबल एस ई डी ड्रेस्ड नाउ द थर्ड वर्ड विच आई हैड सेलेक्टेड दैट इज ब्रश एंड आई एम गोइंग टू एड ई डी ऑन एड सो इट विल बी ब्रश्ड b r u s h e d brushed now the fourth word i have selected that is tie the first line can you see this now add e d on it t i e d tied okay so you all had done this now we are going to do the next exercise now students this is the last exercise which we are going to do 
complete these sentences with the correct word from the brackets so here we have to complete the sentence tia dash birds tia loved birds one day she found a baby parakeet under a tree she picked so select the word picked over here so select the word picked over here up the baby parakeet tia carried tia carried at home she named the parakeet kitu kitu repeated some words that tia spoke kitu washed tia dropped pictures when kitu grew big tia took it to the garden kitu flew away so students your paragraph is given over here and the words are given in the bracket so we have to select the correct word and write it down over here okay so i had done it for you all now this exercise is finished all the exercise of lesson 4 is finished grammar worksheet so what you have to do you have to note it down in the book itself okay students i hope you all are taking good care of yourself goodbye students take care